Hi there. In this video, we'll be reviewing how to get started with the Y charts and Adapar integration. To get started, go ahead and hover over Support and click on Integrations. This will take you to the integrations homepage where you can go ahead and activate your integrations. Now, if this is the first time you're looking to use the Adapar and Y charts integration, you'll notice that your status should say inactive. To activate your status, you can go ahead and click on Manage and click on Activate. Once you click on Login to Adapar, this will take you to Adapar to log in and bring you back into Y charts. If you've successfully logged in, you'll notice that your status has been changed to active. Now you're ready to start importing portfolios from Adapar. To begin the import process, go ahead and hover over Tools and click on Model Portfolios. Within the Model Portfolios list page, you'll notice in the top right, you can start importing holdings. Once you click on that dropdown, you can click on Adapar to begin that process. You'll notice you can either search by group or you can click on portfolio and return either all clients, all funds, all legal entities, or all accounts within your Adapar account. For this example, let's go ahead and click on accounts. Once you've selected the correct account to pull in, you can go ahead and click on import. This will prompt you to the Model Portfolio Editor page, where you'll notice a lot of things are pre-filled, like the name of the portfolio, the description, and your holdings and underlying weights of that model portfolio. Once you've changed the settings to what you desire, you can go ahead and click on Save, which will begin the calculation process within Y Charts. Once that portfolio is done calculating, you can use it like any other portfolio on Y charts. You can start off by looking at the quote page, which has great information about the portfolio's performance, risk statistics, allocation data, holdings data, and so much more. From here, you can also toggle over to other tabs to get additional information on this model portfolio from Adapar. And lastly, you can also click on the reports menu to run reports within this model portfolio. These are great for overview reports where you can just view this model portfolio and all of its information. A side by side report where you can compare this model portfolio to another portfolio or security within Y charts, or even a tear sheet where you just get a clean one page report of this model portfolio. To learn more about the Y charts and Adapar integration, reach out to your support contact and they'll be able to help you get set up.